of November, 1982. Three unarmed men, suspected members of the provisional IRA, were shot and killed during a chase here at Tully Galley Road East. Two weeks later, members of the same crack squad, the Special Support Unit, gunned down two young men in a hay shed here at Ballyneri Road North. Finally, an SSU officer shoot two INLA members at a housing estate outside Armagh. They too were unarmed. We're here to conduct a full investigation into these three incidents. We are not here, in spite of what some of you may have read in the press, we are not here conduct an examination into the existence of the so-called shoot-to-kill policy in the province. Now, certain allegations have been made concerning the manufacture of cover stories by senior special branch officers for at least one of these three incidents. Doubts have been cast as to the uh, thoroughness of the CID investigation resulting in considerable public concern. This is to be an outside, independent, and above all, objective inquiry. This is for them. Right. Now, Sir John Herman has promised us his full cooperation, and the relevant CID files are on the way over, so... Ron, I want you to handle Tully Galley. Uh, Brian, you take the hay shed and Jim, Malakrivi Park. Eileen, you look after forensic, all right? The DCI Simons will coordinate your findings. And I'll be in day-to-day -day operational control. I'm afraid all of you are going to have to get used to the idea of being away from your families for what may turn out to be a considerable length of time. And I should imagine that most of your days will be spent uh, shifting bits of paper from one pile to another. But I don't need to remind you of the importance of the task in hand. And besides, there's music while you work. <laughs> Come in. The files have arrived from CID, sir. All right, we'll bring them in and stack them over here for the time being, will you? These are they, sir. Tully Galley, the hay shed, Malacrevy Park. That's it. So, what can I do for you, gentlemen? We need to see the intelligence files on each of the men shot in the three incidents under investigation. All right. Three T's, please. Your superior must have told you that those files are restricted. I'd imagine they would be, yes. Yes. Well, leave it with me. I'll see what I can do.
So, you got your teeth? What about the files, sir? Yes. Sorry, no can do. Permission denied. My team cannot progress with this inquiry without access to those files, sir. The information you are requesting is available on a need-to-know basis. What exactly do you need to know, Mr. Stock? I'll tell you that when I've seen those files. These men were terrorists. My men were under threat. What more do you need to know? The Greater Manchester Police are only here to do a job. As soon as we've done it, we'll go home. Look out here, Mr. Stalker. There's a war out in those streets. Oh, the politicians in Westminster won't tell you it's a war. But my men, I am a provost. And everyone who lives out there, they know it's a war. We need warriors, not pussyfooters, not paper pushers. I need to see those files. Leave it at me. I'll see what I can do. Sorry, sir. You're expressly forbidden to take notes. That's a bloody useless. <laughs> 